Yeah, I called you a bitch. You want to walk away from me? I've been working out. I did a whole in like 25 squats today. <laughs>
Patrick, I know that you like to play Wizards of Waverly Place, but you can't just disappear on me like this, man. You're a fucking starfish. You're not a magician. I mean, you could be a star one day, but I think you're missing the point of you're a fish. You're not an actual... F <laughs> okay, he heard me dissing him. I'm sorry, Patrick. All right, we're gonna get a uh, Tropica, which is not milky, but that's okay because we gotta feed the... <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I ruined everything. Oh my god. I broke it. I dropped it on the ground. It's oozing all over the place. Do you think if I give him milk, will he notice that it's not orange juice? If I piss in the f***ing bottle, do you think he'll be able to tell the difference? I'm an anime girl, so our piss probably tastes like cupcakes. I wouldn't know. I don't like that kind of stuff. Some dirty f out there probably does. Patrick, uh, actually, hang on. I'm just gonna be another second or two. I'm so sorry. I dropped the orange. Ah! I'm sorry. I dropped the orange juice here. It's, uh, it's, it's totally legitimate. It's great. Oh, buddy. Oh, this sick. Ah! Um, um, are you okay? Did the orange juice really make you feel that good? Uh, he's just dead in ecstasy. I, I hope. I think. <laughs> Okay, that's gotta be something. Um, you stay there. I'm gonna go get a hazmat suit so I can clean up your body and then not waste other people's times. Uh, SpongeBob, are you... <sighs> one, two. So we have step one is SpongeBob. Then I think we gotta do WD. And then we gotta do W, and then apparently we end up saving Patrick, maybe? I, I don't know what the hieroglyphs in the pictures mean, man. I'm an adult. Picture books are for babies, and I'm above the age of 18, man. I'm in my fucking 20s. This is not my type of shit, but I do know that this man is having a very bad time. I'm gonna push the button. SpongeBob! Hi! I like your cartoons. You're not looking so good, though, SpongeBob. You look a little bit deflated from the last time that I saw you. How you doing? Broski, so nice to see you. Uh, you're looking you? real. Who are you, dude? I'm I'm your best friend. I'm Mel Immunness. We used to spend every single Saturday morning together. I watched you religiously with my brother and my dad. How do you not know who I am, man? Help me. Help me? I mean, yeah, I guess I can help you. What What do you need, man? He's behind me, and no, he's not. Look at that, you fucking liar. Why'd you lie to me? I'm right at like your fucking penis, and you're sitting here lying to me. I'm not choking on your sponge anymore. Gross. No more sponge up the f***ing vagina. Oh. Alright. Spongebob, we're gonna escape. I'm taking you with me. Your cock is in my hand. <laughs> yeah! Fuck! How did that happen? I had his cock inside of my hand, and I started to move it, and all of a sudden, I just had a pink thing pop out at me? I don't think that this is how this is supposed to work. It's supposed to be white. If there's pink in there, that means you have to go to the doctor because something is very, very not right. Okay. Well, we're gonna try this again. Okay. Go, 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 go. Run, bitch, run! Get the f*** out of Dodge! Yeah, baby! Woo! All right. Sponge bubble. No! I got stuck between a couch. Step bro! Except for step bro, it's Patrick f***ing star just coming to make my ass cheeks just yeah, look like an entirely fuck. different thing than what they're supposed to. Come on, Spongebob, just a little bit more, baby. A little bit more. We're gonna bust out of here, man. We're gonna bust out of here, and then I'm gonna bust in you. You beautiful, delightful sponge you. It doesn't even matter where I bust in you. You have so many different holes. I can use a new hole every f***ing day. Oh, baby. See, Spongebob liked it. This is good. <laughs> piece of wood <laughs> <laughs> we piece of wood our way out of here karen i'm so okay i guess she got a new headstone for her living room that's definitely a new one spongebob also just decided to have some freaky f action on my face so that's also exciting hi sonic nice to see your f***ing pink hole again i was not expecting us to be in a rave but yeah boy Oh my goodness, why don't they all have eyes though? All right, we're off to find Doodle Bob. We gotta go through a maze here for a second. Ooh, gotta make my way through the dance floor. Sup, hottie? Yeah, 
you move your booty like that in the bedroom too? Because if not, you should. Hi, my name's Mello. Hang on, let me just uh, stand. Oh god, I didn't realize that your face, you, you have mouths on both sides of you. Actually, that's kind of f***ing kinky as shit, man. <laughs> Ooh, well. <laughs> I may or may not be down for that. Hi, Doodle Bob! <laughs> oh my god, he really just went. Blah, 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 blah. Hi, we're having a great party here. Hell yeah, we are, man. Come on, dance with us. Oh, don't mind if I do. Ooh, Doodle Bob, this is so much fun. I've never been to a party. Being able to jam with you is incredible, but we need you. You have to come with me to save the world, though. Oh, Doodle Bob. Yes, let's go together. I'm totally going home with, like, the hottest guy in this entire club, man. Doodle Bob, why would you shut me out? There you are. Doodle Bob, um, you're not supposed to have the mascara just coming down your face like that until after we passionately make out for six hours inside of your bedroom, may or may not, with your pencil inside of me. But I mean, I appreciate that you're going through the efforts of doing this early, because it's kind of turning me on. If I had a dick, it'd be hard, at least like semi right now, so that's something. <laughs> Where is it? Where's my dear pencil? Oh, I don't know. Did you drop it? Did you lend it to, like, the cute boy inside of class? Give me back my pencil or I'm gonna kill you. Buddy, what makes you think that I fucking took it? I'm a VTuber. I can't even move my hands except to fucking flip you off. Like, how am I gonna take your fucking pencil? I swear, Doodle Bob, it wasn't me. It was him. That one right there, so officer. He is clearly the one who took it. Look at him. He looks so guilty. He's sitting there just screaming it wasn't him, but they always say that the guiltiest people are the ones who scream the loudest. I should not be saying that because I'm definitely fulfilling that whole entire, like, proverb of every time you point at somebody, you got four fingers back uh, pointing at yourself. Uh, <laughs> whoops. Take this map and find my pencil now. All right, well, I guess we get to, you know, play the game of finds the pencil blindfolded. <laughs> That's kind of hot, not gonna lie. Pencil! Hello! I'm just a cute little anime girl looking to be able to, you know, find you. I'm looking for my man, looking for us to have a good time. Oh, a triangle. Who's screaming? What? Ah! Jesus! Doodle Bob, you can't just be screaming like that, my boy! All right, well... I don't like this, guys. Why is he doing this to me? Actually, what the f*** is even happening? Bruh. Actual f***ing bruh. I don't even know what the f*** to do about this shit, man. He just keeps coming and he don't stop coming. Can you use those black lockers? I have no idea. I feel like I'm just in Squid Game right now and he's just, you know. Stop f***ing screaming. I'm not a f***ing kindergarten teacher for a reason, you goddamn pleb. There once was a fellow... Oh, you like that, you little bitch? Yeah, I can't find me because I'm in the locker. I'm a loser. Some footballer threw me in here. Now you think that I'm fucking pathetic and you don't want to continue to spit on my fucking grave so that way my parents are sad that it's disintegrating when they spent $600 on a goddamn fucking rock. Yeah. Alright, I'm done with this shit. Fuck this game. Maybe we'll come back and play it. That is so needlessly difficult. I don't even know how to begin to express it. It's something where I'm sure I could probably figure it out at some point, but I just don't give a flying to. That game is not worth my time. You can call me a wimp, you can call me a pussy, you can call me anything that you want, uh, as long as you call me. Ooh, well. Alright, egg fried rice, let's play this shit, see how it goes. I have no idea anything about this game other than that it just looked stupid. And it's supposed to be a horror game. Oh, I'm far too hungry. I'm never gonna get to sleep. My hunger just yearns to be stuffed. It just needs something inside of it so bad. Oh, why the cravings are ridiculous. I just am sitting there looking at my phone being like, don't go to Grubhub. Don't think about going to the 24-7 gas station. You just need to sit there and deal with it. You got work tomorrow morning. But alas, it gurgles and it just forces me to reckon with the fact that I do in fact have cravings that 
God put inside of me, and I just need to have something else put inside of me. Oh, God. All right, our task is to look for food. Is that food? No, that's my college diploma, which might as well be food because it's f***ing useless. Oh, I can call? Oh, my God, is that a pizza menu? Oh, my fucking God, I think that's a sushi menu. Do I actually have any food? Mom always says we got food at home. My fridge is empty? What kind of a f***ing, like, pathetic human being am I? It's not like my fridge currently at my home is empty. Oh my god, cereal. Dude, we got no milk. You know what? I'm a slut. I'll be able to just raw this f***ing cereal. If people get dicked down raw, I'm a dick down raw here too. Well, every single time that you have a car, you have to R R R in order to get it to move for you, so... Oh, <laughs> I'm just a bitch going out for a f***ing ride. Um, I probably should have looked both ways, but this is cool. Chinese food, let me in. Well, please let me in. Okay, they better be open. Oh, oh. Hey, you, uh, you gonna finish that there, bud? If I press my tits on the window, will you actually let me, uh, have a, a bite or two of your delicious food? I'm very hungry, and I'm very poor, and I'm very cold. Please, sir, or madame. I don't discriminate. Both of you can see my f***ing honkers if you want. Hello! Oh my god, you're beautiful! Hi, staff person! I love how immediately I put my hand on your tit. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do that. I just want some egg fried rice. One egg fried rice, please. Of course. That will be 280. 280 for egg fried rice? Incredible! Oh no, I forgot- No! I will quickly drive back to my home and I will get my money. Um, otherwise, you don't, you don't mind if I pay you in, uh, other services, right? Like, uh, you know, so many good things. Um, like, I'll, I'll clean your dishes in your back room. I'll also clean your apartment. That's worth 280 to me. Yes, that is fine. Your food will take a few minutes to prepare. So it should be ready by the time you come back. Do not take too long. We must close soon. Oh my god, dude, if you close soon, I've worked retail. Believe me, woman, I will ensure that I am back on fucking time. We're about to go supersonic speed. This is now, uh, racing down the highway. <laughs> hey, bitch, you checking me out? You looking at me with that kind of face? You think that men like you can talk to ladies like me? Cause hell yeah, you can. How you doing, man? You got a cute little face there. You got, uh, stains on your shirt. Hopefully it's not blood. Uh, if it is, uh, just don't tell me about it. I'll go back to your trailer. But also, damn, boy, what are those? Enough shit talking. It's time to move. Shmove. All right, turn. Okay, maybe we don't turn. I don't think I can turn around. Oh, God! Oh, shit! Whoever wanted me to crash my car, there you go. Oh, Jesus. Okay, three-point turn. I'm, I'm proving here that anime girls can't actually drive. Look at that three-point turn, baby. In the f***ing incredible. Oh, I forgot to turn on my lights. Okay, there we go. Rolling around at the speed of sound. Got places to go. We gotta follow the rainbow. Except for there is no rainbow. There's only darkness inside of light. Hello. Is something wrong? Of course not. I'm back with the money. What do you mean? Payment for my egg fried rice? Duh. I literally was in here five minutes ago. Is this 50 first dates or something? Because, woman, I know that I'm like a basic white chick, but I feel like I should not be that f***ing forgettable. Did your friend not tell you? He paid for your egg fried rice. Yo! I have a friend who is nice enough to buy me food, and I'm not sucking their f***ing penis? This is incredible. This has never happened in the life of being a woman ever. I am actually just dumbfounded, awestruck. Everything about me, I've just struck gold. This is absolutely marvelous. My friend? Yeah, the man that came in with you before. Oh, he did not come in me before. I never saw that man in my f***ing life here. I'm still a virgin, and that way I can get married in the eyes of the Lord and not be shunned. He paid up and said he would take your egg fried rice straight to you. He's no friend of mine. He's just trying to take the last f***ing fried rice away from me, and I will not stand for it. He's definitely adding some quote-unquote special sauce, which may or may not be arsenic and or semen. And either way, I'm not putting that in my mouth from a dude that I don't know, man. That's terrifying. You let him take my food? <laughs> this poor woman has to be like, dude, I'm not paid enough for this shit. Well, yes. He said he told me. Oh, dear. I'm sorry. We were about to lock up, but I will ask our chef for another egg fried rice. Thank you. That would be great. I don't believe this. 
Why would that man take my food? Maybe he was just gonna use it as an excuse to like talk to me or something. I mean, I did say that his ass was flat, but that's not as much of a big deal for men these days as it is for women. So I don't know. What a loser. What a poser. What a f***ing phony. I hope that he gets uh, toothpicks jammed underneath his fingernails. I hope that he ends up going to Alcatraz and he's stuck on there as the only f***ing pathetic pussy bitch that is on an island full of shame they're gonna stop doing tours for two weeks and he's just gonna end up starving to death and then they're gonna find him in a puddle of his own filth just dead go f yourself stealing my fucking food i paid for that shit i mean i didn't but like i would have paid for that shit i cannot even believe the audacity of this gentleman you know what there's nothing gentle about him he is simply a piece of shit is what he is he is corpolite he has fossilized shit he's not even shit anymore he's a goddamn rock and somehow that makes it even fucking worse aliens are gonna look at him and be like damn there's no intelligent life even on this planet there is only produce in people who make dookies hi sorry you heard my bitch rant here you go sorry for the mix-up that's okay there's no harm done Here's your money. Thank you. Don't forget to pick up your egg fried rice before you leave. Good night. Aw, thank you. What a sweetie pie. Good night. Okay, where's my egg fried rice? Hello, Mr. Kitchen Staff, man. You got my fucking food, bitch? Oh, there's my... There it is. Mmm, looks delicious, dude. You can't even tell what that is. Is that pizza? Is that casserole? I don't know. My god, they even got a cute-ass little aquarium with fish? Iconic. Honestly, that made my day brighter. I hope it made your day brighter, too. Mmm, I cannot wait to go put my entire f***ing face inside of this rice. Oh, hello, sir. How are you? You are a very vibrant-looking man. Hey. Dude, this man is high off his f***ing mind. He is speaking in Rainbow Road. That's when you know that you're pretty f***ing high, because every Rainbow Road takes place, like, far up in the universe. That's pretty a wild. I got a favor to ask you, you know. I need a few pennies for the bus. Friends help each other out, man. Right, friends? You know what? I'm, I'm gonna give him some spare coins. Home dog seems like he needs an extra gram or two. Thanks, you're a hero. Dude, I'm just, you know, saving people one uh, fucking penny at a time. They'll be writing songs about you, friend. Just a heads up. Some creepy dude went running after your car when you left earlier. He gave me weird vibes, man, you know? Keep your eyes peeled. Aw, thank you, vibrant man. See, this is why you give strangers who are cracked out inside of alleys money. Because then they just tell you that weirdos are following you and trying to, you know, just chase down your car at night. That's kind of f***ed up. Nobody's in my car, right? Nope, it's just me. Me and my sweet leather seats. Bye, homie! I'll miss you! I love you! Please make sure you get clean! I know a rehab center like three doors down. Alright, bye! Nyeroom. <laughs> what are we playing? We're playing a game called Egg Fried Rice, and it's very strange. It's a horror game, but... Officer, I swear they jumped on my vehicle. It definitely was not me. Oh, god damn it. Do I get venison or do I have to go to prison? Ew! Is that egg fried rice? Oh my god! I said no! I said I didn't want to suck this man's dick and he just decides to throw food at my car? What is wrong with him? Alright, well, shots f***ing fired, man, or I should say an egg dropped because we are about to have a f***ing problem here. I just want to eat my egg fried rice. I'm going to lick it off the windshield. Ugh. I'm not actually going to do that. I'm going to get some extra protein bean bugs there. Alright, I don't see anybody back in my car. Oh god, I can't see f***ing shit. Um, dude, this is so bad. I actually can't f***ing see shit. I can't even turn on my f***ing lights. Oh, there we go. Okay. Whew. Crisis evaded. I'm gonna sit down and eat some egg fried rice. Would you like some? That's a big deal. My tummy hungry and I want to make sure I eat. Oh, yes. Oh, who the f*** is calling me? Hello? Hello, is this the Chinese takeaway? No, this is Patrick. We have a free bottle of beer for you. A free fortune cookie, too. Please come and collect them. 
Oh, I ain't falling for that shit, man. Dude, I already got my free food. Nobody, except for when you're a cute girl at a festival, is ever going to give you a free beer. What's this? I'm standing in front of a bookshelf? Do I look like a bitch who goes to festivals? No, I sit home and I read and hentai at 2 a.m. I am not somebody who is out there having a great ass time here, man. I am not falling for this shit. This man is not trying to plunge his dick into me. He is trying to plunge a knife into my forehead and it is not 1960 and I am not getting lobotomized today. Thank you very much. Please come and collect them. No. Hello? Bitch, if you fall for this, you are so dumb. You dumb girl. They hung up. Weird. I could go quick and pick up the free beer and fortune cookie. My fried rice would stay warm if I hurry. But should I? No. You're gonna eat your f***ing fried rice. They closed. They're definitely not reopening for me. I've worked retail for so long, man. Nobody's gonna do that shit. You could literally be the queen of England and they're just gonna sit there and be like, Nah, fam. I'm not staying open for you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Rice, 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 rice. Woo, woo, woo. I'm so happy. Happy, happy. Be. Dude, listen to those munching noises. Oh man, we got f***ing dialogue. You slept safely, but at what cost? After finishing your egg fried rice, you went back to bed. As soon as your head hit the pillow, you fell into a deep, peaceful sleep. However, the next morning you woke feeling haunted by your decision to turn down a free drink and fortune cookie due to a little fear and uneasiness. The memory of this seemingly poor choice caused you to live the rest of your life with an unshakable sensation of hollowness. The mental hang-up of rooting an otherwise nice meal meant you could never again fully enjoy the once delicious taste of egg fried rice. Get f***ing out of here. I saved my life and the game has the audacity to be like, um, a bitch. No, you didn't. You are going to be haunted by the beers of your Christmas past because you should have gone back and legitimately gotten fucking shank. I can't even believe it, man. There are four endings to this game. That's insanity. I did not even know that that's possible. So what if we ain't pussy, uh, go and check it out you know what i feel like we should let's let's do it most of the time i don't end up going okay. past 11. i kind of want to see what happens i hope that you guys do too we'll speed through this hello sir hello there have we met before no i don't think we have hmm perhaps you're right but you certainly look familiar i must be mistaken my age does that to me from time to time well be careful out there all the same careful why don't you read the papers? It's dangerous to be alone at night. Take this. I'll never get used to the violence in towns and titties, cities such like- <laughs> I like how I just mispronounce cities as titties. My god. I am so gooner. It is actually ridiculous. Oh, here I go rambling again. I don't get many chances to talk to folk these days. Think on it no more. Oh yeah, I like how I just flashed him with my f***ing light too. Alright, you f***er. If you murder me, I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna actually just kill you dead this is a threat i have seen how to curb stop and i have high fucking heels man you're not gonna know the bitch that you messed with i'm gonna stick a q-tip in his ear i'm gonna make sure i push a little bit too far then he's gonna know what real pain feels like all right i'm gonna try and die this time i am gonna give our drug addict friend some money though because i like i like him and i feel like he just deserves some stuff i love the fact that his text is rainbow Legitimately, this is one of my favorite things I've seen instead of a game. Sometimes it's the simple things in games, like jiggle physics, that really just get you going. But for me, that text just said that whoever made this cares. Like, I genuinely do think, based on how detailed a lot of the things are in this, that they do care. But still, I, f I just feel good about it. We're gonna go get our fucking food. I wanna see what happens. Go collect our free stuff. This is too good to miss. I can't spend the entire rest of my life just moping around at the fact somebody did not give me one free beer. I mean, I got married. I ended up uh, having 13 children. Oh, I guess I'm walking. Oh, well, this is genius. All right. Well, clearly you have balls of steel and you have a brain that is completely empty. We're either going to get hit by a deer or we're going to get hit by something. I guess this way. Is this the right way? I thought that I was supposed to run the other way around. Interesting. Well, I guess we're going over here. Holy crap, it's midnight. It is 11 p.m. for me. What the f***? 
I guess I do just have to walk out in the forest then. No idea why I wouldn't, you know, just walk on the road like a normal human being, but you know, sometimes you take some, or you win some, you lose some, and I guess I'm probably gonna be losing a limb or two, but <laughs> you know what? It happens to everybody who just walks down a country road at 3 a.m. Oh, hi! Hello, sir! Sir? 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 Hi. Sir, hi. Hello? Hello, sir? Pay attention to me. Hi. Um, you, you took my rice, right? You threw it out my car, right? I hope that you have insurance, because you're paying for that shit, you goddamn bitch. Yeah, I called you a bitch. You want to walk away from me, pussy? I've been working out. I did a whole f***ing, like, 25 squats today. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to say that I didn't deserve that. Uh, I might have deserved that. This is why you don't just randomly start shit talking people out in the woods who may or may not have knives. You kept a watchful eye on the strange man and he didn't like it. After killing you, he peeled your face off and wore it as a mask. He lived out the rest of his life posing as you. Your friends and family never questioned your new voice, nor the strange smell of rotting flesh that followed you around. Whenever the strange man is invited out to eat, he always orders the same thing. He chuckles to himself as he eats his delicious egg fried rice. That is so fucking dumb. That is so fucking good. I love it. This is, to me, peak itch.io. Like, itch.io games are really f***ing dumb, but they're just good, man. There's something about it where they're so cheesy and so stupid. It's awesome. See you guys later next time or whatever the f***. So, hell yeah. Bye!